question, who loves white chocolate? Who prefers white chocolate? No sinners in the room, okay. Who prefers milk chocolate? Okay, we've got to convert three. We can do that. We can do that. We've only got about three milk chocolates here. But uh, uh, the Duffy, I'll take you around, Martha, if you want to know afterwards. Um, so that is the cacao pot. Who's ever seen a cacao pot? Yeah. That's the cacao pot. That's the bean. This is the actual bean here. Anyone tasted just raw chocolate? Okay, pass this round. I want to just take one. We will not pay your dental insurance. If you don't, if you don't have good teeth, okay, don't try this. These are wild Bolivian cacao beans. These are very rare. So with the bean, you take them, you crush them in your teeth if you've got good teeth. Yeah. Now you don't want the outer skin. You want to crack it, crack it, and then put it in your hands. So don't eat the outer skin. You can eat the outer skin. And then take what's inside. Now that is 100% chocolate. And just eat that. And then uh, Laura will say spit out the other bits under there. That is 100% chocolate. What do you think of that? Interesting? Now, a couple of chocolates. This chocolate here, this has got nibs in. Basically, it's got that. There's a few other ones. This one here, Grenada, it's got nibs in as well. So, what they do is they put chocolate and add in. That's what they're called nibs. Just eat. We sell 12 different brands of chocolate. We want to have, and we have one of the biggest selections of fine chocolate online in the UK. The chocolate bars up there, yes, hold it high. Those are the most, that is £10 each in Fortnum Masons. It's one of the most expensive chocolate bars in the world. Uh, we, we're actually distributors from that now, and we're selling it at £6.50. It is amazing. I had an issue, I'm half Scottish, as uh, Charlotte as well. A couple of years ago, I couldn't spend three pounds on a bar of chocolate. I, had, I just had a fit. I'm like, what? You know, you can never spend three pounds on a bar of chocolate. Now I will spend just 12, 15, whatever. The nice thing about chocolate is you can have the best chocolate in the world. You know, one of these bars here, this is Duffy's, this is rated in the top 10 bars in the world. It's normally about five quid. You know, what else in the world can you buy that's the best of for five quid? As my friend said, tea. So yes, you can have tea, but nothing else. So nice amount of chocolate is, what I'd love you to do after today is I'm going to talk you around these different chocolates, is actually start eating single origin chocolate. There's 400 different flavors in chocolate. In chocolate, basically there are three groups of beans. There's a Criollo bean. A Criollo bean is the champagne of chocolate. When you think chocolate, think wine. Yeah? And think grapes. Beans think grapes. So Criollo is the champagne. About 1 to 5% of the chocolate in the world is made from Criollo. Then you've got Trinitario. About 15% of the chocolate in the world is Trinitario. I, can, I say that's like a nice Merlot or something. And then you've got the uh, Forestario. And that is where 80% of the chocolate in the world is made from Forestario. It's a bulk bean. Basically, can you imagine, it's like really cheap. Anyone from Bulgaria here? No. It's like having cheap Bulgarian wine for the rest of your life, nothing else. But that's what you have. Most people have bulk beans made in, in uh, Africa, West Africa. So we want you, so we've got some uh, Criollo over there, we've got some Trinitario. We want to give you different beans and taste some of the flavors. If you have, can you hold up the Dos Rios at the top there? To your left, to the left. No, there's nothing. There's, there's nothing. none left. No. Be new. <laughs> this one there is a Dos Rios. This is the most incredible flavor than chocolate. It's got bergamot, it's floral, it's incredible. It's a bit of a marmite. You will love it or hate it. But people have it and say to me, no, you've got flavors in there. I thought, no, there's absolutely no flavors. It's just natural bean flavors. But most of the chocolate you have has got maybe one or two flavors. There's 400 different flavors you have. So, what I would love you to go away from today is to think, try chocolate from around the world. Try some Ecuadorian, try some Venezuelan, try Madagascar. I love Madagascar. Try, uh, you know, try and eat your way around the world. Find your favorite chocolate. There'll be chocolate you don't like, fine, doesn't matter. But find your favorite chocolate. You can spend years, and it's not that expensive, finding great chocolate.